Okay, today we're talking about the UDIRC U818A-1, I believe it is, uh, drone. And here's here's what I here's what I've come to realize. This thing has kind of been a nuisance for me in some ways. I love it. I love playing with it. It's fun. But uh, what I've come to find out over time, it just is losing power. Uh, so I've bought new batteries. And I bought new propellers. I actually broke the propellers that were originally with this and got new ones online, which are the only ones that most of you are going to be able to find that fit it. And uh, there's the housing that it normally has around it. Now the reason why that is off is because, in my opinion, uh, you're going to have less fun with it on there for a couple of reasons. One one thing is the old propellers that came with the unit, they were more rigid than the replacement re propellers. So what I'm finding is that uh, there's a lot of flex. I mean, they they flex, see? They're flexible. And they're a little more durable in the fact that they're kind of chewier or whatever. They don't crack as easily. Uh, the original ones were more rigid, but they cracked easy. Now, here's the problem. This is like a, uh, you know, a, a fan that is self-controlling, and the faster it goes, the flatter it is. So the less lift it has. That's a flaw with, this, with these replacement propellers. The newer ones maintained loft. They maintained angle at the high RPMs that it takes to fly these things. And that kept the loft you know, and the lift in, 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 in good stead. So now that we have the replacement propellers, they're, they're flexible and they flatten out as they spin and put drag and they, you know, the wind, you know, puts pressure on them and they, they sort of flatten out. And that, to me, I think that's just is why the power is not there for the lift. So it kind of, you know, uses the batteries up quick, trying to run it. And, uh, basically it, it, peters out and doesn't really want to fly. It only flies a couple feet off the ground for most of the uh, short time the batteries are, are there. So anyhow, here's what I've figured out. If you take the body off, a couple of things happen. It lightens the load up considerably and it flies like a champ. I mean, just crazy. It, it, just, it just scoots and it goes way up there, no problem. Secondly, if it gets stuck in a tree, which it has, and I mean it was in a high tree, if I had that on there, the branch would have gone right through, and I would have been still up there, and it would have been history. Well, with it like this, I know you'd think, oh, this is this is kind of more dangerous. No, these blades are are pretty durable. They're they they don't crack easy. I've slammed them into things. Um, the uh, the fact is, though, is that there's not much for it to hang up on there, and and if it's stuck in there, you can kind of it kind of walks out of the tree if you have any of this action with the motors at all. And I've had and I've done that. I've gone zap, zap, zap with the controller, and and it just fell out of the tree. Thank God, I got my drone back. Uh, I guarantee, if it had that body, it would not have. Not only would it have not gotten up there because it's too heavy, it would have uh, still been up there. Here's the thing I did to make it nice though. I took an old Folgers container, just a plastic container of some kind that's got a nice dimension that works well. And uh, this is a single hole punch and you can see that the, I punched holes and uh, that, is, that is how I've got that affixed in the same manner that they had it attached. See. Uh, pull that back out. So that gives some protection to the guts. It's kind of neat that it's transparent because the LEDs light up inside there. And uh, it just is lightweight as all get out. That thing just is super lightweight and still maintains the, uh, the lightness that it requires to be a great flyer. So, hey, if you're having trouble with your drone, um, not flying anymore after you put new blades on it. Well, that's my theory. And if you just take the body off and try it out, you're going to go, oh my goodness. That is the solution. Take it easy. Hope that helps.